What is up, everybody? Jay's here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out a new release, guys. This actually released yesterday. We just did, we didn't get it in until today, guys. So it is here now. 23-24 Upper Deck SP Game Use Hockey, guys. Connor Bedard, rookie year. He's probably the biggest chase in the hockey hobby. Uh, and honestly, in the hobby in a while, guys. I mean, this, this guy's stuff is just flying. Everybody wants a piece of whatever that comes out of his new releases, so... Like I said, a very, very fun, exciting chase to get him going. So this is SP Game Use Hockey, guys, a two-box break. You get four random teams, uh, break number one, guys. And again, obviously, 32 teams, so we're going to times your names by four. Every box contains one autograph or a premium memorabilia card, three extra memorabilia cards, tech cards, or two base inserts, um, base sets, or an insert cards. Now, the one thing about SP Gaming is that's always been very popular, guys, is that they create a base uh, card number to the jersey of these players. So, for Conor Bedard, I believe he's 98, so they're going to create 98 base uh, out of uh, 98, right? If I remember correctly, if, if they still do this, which I'm pretty sure they do, if you hit the jersey number 98 of 98, it actually will be autographed. So, I think that's a really fun chase, but those are usually uh, really fun to chase, and they sell extremely, extremely well. Of course, on top of getting like the inked rookie sweaters and you know stuff like that, they also have draft day patch autographs. It's pretty awesome stuff, guys. And this is where you can also get the nets from uh, like the Winter Classics and stuff like that Stadium Series, which is really fun. So I'm pretty excited to rip this, guys. I haven't ripped any of SP Game Use in a, in a while, guys. So this should be fun. So I times the names by four, uh, obviously by four, since you get four random teams. So there's all of them there. There's obviously all 32 teams in. We're gonna click dice roll. It's gonna be a five and a six 11 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Five and a six, 11. We got Brian Heyman at the top, down to Kev at the bottom. And of course, 11 times here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 11 times, 11 times. Florida Panthers down to the Pittsburgh Penguins. All right, so here we go. 11 times, 11 times. Let's see what you guys got. Brian with the Panthers, and there you go. Congratulations on getting the Hawks. Now let's get you a Bedard. Obviously, there's a lot of other great rookies in this class too, guys. Um, so, And obviously, besides that, you can chase all the nice veteran stuff. Um, and obviously, uh, just in general, some really cool relics and autographs. Jeremy Poor, you got the Blues. Yankee with the Blue Jackets. Craig with the Bruins. Jeremy Poor with the Capitals. Devils. Yankee with the uh, Hurricanes. Craig with the Leaves. Tristan with my Kings. Kev with the Flames. Tristan with the Knights. Brian with the Yotes. Craig with the Jets. Jeremy Poor with the Red Wings. Craig with the Ducks. Kev with the Oilers. Jeremy Poor with the Flyers. Tristan with the Stars. Brian with the Avalanche. Jeremy Poor with the Rangers. Kev with the Islanders. Jeremy Poor with the San Jose Sharks. Tristan with the Preds. Yankee with the Canadians, as well as. Uh, Tristan with the Sabres, Jeremy with the Canucks, Tristan with the Wild, Senators, and Kraken, Yanko with the Lightning, and Kev with the Pittsburgh Penguins. And yeah, guys, let me see if I can pull up a checklist for you guys. I'm pretty sure it's already out. Um, and like I said, really, really fun stuff. You can always get out of here. So it looks like that's what like, the base card might look like. There's some like authentic rookie jersey autographs. There's the neck cords I was talking about. Looks like they have Stanley Cup final neck cords, which is freaking awesome. All right. They also have some all-star mascot fabrics. All right. There's the patches there. Ink rookie sweaters. Looks like a deep cut. It's a new a new version here, looks like. New to SP Game Use, which looks pretty awesome. And yeah, it looks like the team sets are here, so I can drop in the checklist here for you guys. That's right, WrestleMania, baby. I heard that uh, they're trying to work with Jason Kelsey to somehow make an appearance at WrestleMania and work with him in the future now that he's retired. Jason Kelsey would freaking kill it in wrestling, dude. He'd be so popular.
Really? Exactly. That's kind of cool. Yeah, I think Jason Kelsey, man, the way he built his brand with the uh, with his brother in the podcast, man, I, I feel like a lot of people love him now, and I, I just feel like now he's kind of set up to, you know, have a second career and, and you know doing whatever he really wants, man, from podcasting. I mean, I don't know if you guys have seen the Kelsey documentary or not on uh, Amazon Prime, but that dude always is always like, you know. Never like to just stay. Not, I'm just saying never like to stay at home, but he always uh, liked to stay busy because, like you said, you know, he just when football's over, like he needs to have a he needs to do something else with his life. You know, he just doesn't he doesn't want to just sit around and do nothing at home. You know, obviously he has a family and stuff like that, which I'm sure he loves to spend time with him like that. But you know, wants to continue on with a, another career. So i feel like now with him building his brand with that new heights podcast it has really leveled up leveled him up really big so i mean so many people want to work with him because i feel like he's very marketable and uh like i said i mean at this point he can probably do whatever he wants now and whatever and whatever he wants to do Get a lot of boxes here, obviously. So we're gonna do our best to try to uh, get all of these here. And yeah, I'm just gonna generate two random numbers, guys, and then from here on out, we're just gonna grab randomly. Of course, we have no idea where it's what. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. And I believe what is there? 18 boxes in this? Five, six. Yeah, it looks like 18. So let's. Uh, Let's get a little uh, generator number going. Last game, they lost to the Wizards and the Grizzlies. It could be, you know, a bit disturbing, but they, at the end of the day, they have a core group of guys that have won a championship, but they also have so, Jeff. Time, right? It's about six games left. All right, generate two numbers. Nine and four. So here's four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. All righty. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, Eric, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm like, always starstruck when I, when I meet, like, players and celebrities. Especially, like, people that, like, I cheer for all the time, you know? So even though it sounds fun to do a potential, like, podcast with Jason, Kelsey, and Travis, I mean, I'd be freaking... I don't think I'd do extremely well, to be honest. <laughs> Kirby Dodge. But with no camera on, probably. 109 out of 223. And then we got a Matthew Cornato for the Flames. To 199. Then we have a New Grooves to 25. Yaroslav Askarov. That's going to go to the uh, Sabres. 
My saber's actually sorry. Predators. Uh, natural predator is going to Tristan. Quinn Hughes. For Vancouver. Oh, I know. I wish I had that mindset, Eric. You have to remember, guys, I'm a very shy person, honestly. I really am. Doing this for the last few years, I've really grown. <laughs> and again, I think it's much easier because I'm talking to you guys in the chat and not in real, real, and face to face, you know? There's Zero Slav again there. And the last one here is a Owen Beck banner year. So these are like manufactured patches of like the banner of the year they were drafted at the uh, NHL draft event. I think it doesn't really matter to me. It could be all three of them. I mean, I could probably have a conversation with Travis and Jason. What the hell am I going to talk to with Taylor Swift about? The only thing I'm going to ever tell her is that, like, my wife got me into your music as of late. And then you dating Travis has made me become a bigger fan. All right, we got a Doug Gilmore to 260. We have a Winter Classic Sydney Crosby banner here for the Penguins. Mike, I already told you. I'll be starstruck by anybody, dog. Bad Bunny, I'd, even worse. Because I'd have to have, like, a probably a formal conversation with him in Spanish. Like, very fluent. Which, if I'm already nervous, I'm not going to speak fluent Spanish at that point. So probably even worse with him. At least speaking English is a little bit easier. <laughs> you know? 24 out of 25. Game used. SP debut. Owen Beck. And then we got a... Samuel Nazco for the Blue Jackets Authentic Rookies. I was hoping to get a Fantilli. But hey, that's a nice one there. For the Blue Jackets going to Yanka. And last hit. Or sorry, two hits from now. Hunter McCohen. That's another one there for the Blue Jackets. And how about a third hit for the Blue Jackets? Jesus. Johnny Goudreau. All right, guys, nothing super crazy here in the first two boxes. So I'm looking for that Connor Bedard in the next two boxer, guys. Thank you guys so much. Again, the next one is in the store. Let's run it back, guys. Thank you.